In this lesson, I'll show you how to predict the sign of entropy change. The question reads, predict the sign of delta S for each process. Delta S represents entropy here, and is generally the amount of disorder or molecular chaos in a system. In question A, we have H2O gas, and it forms H2O liquid. Since a gas generally has a higher entropy than a liquid, generally gases have more disorder than liquid molecules, the entropy decreases from gas to liquid it becomes more orderly, and delta S, therefore, is negative. So here, delta S is negative. The sublimation of solid carbon dioxide. Sublimation is the process of going from a solid, skipping the liquid phase, and right into gas. Since a solid has a lower entropy than a gas, the entropy increases, and delta S is positive. So when the entropy increases, we have a positive value. In question C, we have a gas forming two separate gases. As you can tell, when you have a single molecule, it's more orderly than if you have two different types of gas molecules. So entropy here is increasing. And when entropy increases, this will be positive. What about the boiling of water? The boiling of water is the process of going from liquid to gas. Liquid is more orderly in terms of its molecular composition than a gas is. Therefore, this is, again, positive. It's the opposite of A. Next, we have a gas going to a solid. This will be negative because we're going from something that is less orderly to something that is more. And finally, in F, a solid forming a solid and a gas. Originally, we had one molecule all compact and in the products, we have a solid and a gas, so it's becoming less orderly, and so it's positive. The take home message here is that if you're going from a gas to a liquid or a solid, entropy decreases, and you make it negative. If it's going from a solid to a liquid, or a liquid to a gas, or even sublimation, then entropy is increasing, and you make it positive. And there you have it. That is how to predict the sign of entropy change.